welcome back to school of civil engineering this is Adatullah with another new video as we have started our uh, CSSF 2016 tutorial series and this is its lesson 2 and in this lesson I'll just discuss about uh, another part of CSI safe 2016 so I have uh, opened that software here and uh, in our previous video I have shown you that how we'll uh, started a new model our uh, new project and how we'll just modify that from here actually okay so i'll not uh, change that actually now so just simply i'll close here and uh, i'm sorry 14 is the unit i will use a us unit and i will use grid only so then I'll just press cancel I will use blank first of all so uh, that is our model actually um, in our previous lecture I have just discussed about it so now in this lecture I will just show that how we will define our materials okay I will define our materials in CSSF 2016 so uh, if you're new to our channel then don't forget to subscribe to our channel and also press the bell icon so that you get every update ever first after that so to define materials just simply click here and define then materials and from here just see here they have three default uh, materials type okay just uh, I will not use that and if you want you can use that so I'll just go here add new materials okay add new materials now from here uh, I'll just give her F F prime C okay two eight zero zero PSI right after that this is the this type is concrete okay and also we can uh, change our materials display color so what will be the color of that properties and materials note you can also give a note here actually so I'll just cancel it after that uh, from here first of all we'll come here okay other properties of concrete materials this is most important just we'll change it this is uh, 2800 PSI that means 2.2.2 8 ksi 2.8 keeps per square inch okay after that after um, i am actually after changing that value here um, it is okay it is okay it's 1.5 and into 10 to the power 2 that means 150 this is the same now the most important thing is we have to change modulus of elasticity e modulus of elasticity we have to change that actually uh, when we will change that value here it will not change automatically that's why we have to change it here modulus of elasticity 3600 and uh, we'll just calculate that what is the modulus of elasticity to calculate that I will just uh, show you a value okay here as per ACI code okay as per ACI code it's not clear actually so uh, as per ACI code if you see here as, as per ACI code it's uh, showing when uh, LB per inch square okay LB per inch square then we will use 5700 root root over FC prime okay FC prime is LB per inch square okay so we'll use 5700 into root over FC prime so i will just actually i'll close that so this is the model of elasticity and uh, it will be different for your country or for your country code okay so i'm just using for aci that's why 5700 root over fc prime after that we'll just uh, we can calculate that okay we can calculate that uh, also we can directly we can directly write here two sorry five seven S 
sorry I will just uh, calculate it by using my calculator so first of all this is 57000 into uh, here this is the Uh, I'm sorry actually uh, 5700 here is the root uh, into root over sorry first of all I will just uh, use a square root of 28 2800 zero zero square root okay this is the uh, root value then I will multiply that with 57000 zero zero. so actually this is the value in a uh, pound but we have to give uh, the value in uh, here keep per square inch so I will just uh, divided that by 1000 here this is the 3016 so i'll just give a value modulus of elasticity 3016 okay 3016 it's done after that uh, we have defined everything perfectly then i'll just click ok and the uh, poison ratio i'm just considering 0 0.2 also you can uh, change that value according to requirement and it's done actually so press and also if you have a lightweight concrete you can use that the strength reduction factor of your lightweight concrete but we have no lightweight concrete so i'll just simply press ok so we have defined our uh, materials fc prime now we will define our river so add new materials here our uh, river or a uh, river will consider as 60 ksi okay 60 ksi bar now i will consider from here uh, this is the river okay this is river and our modulus of elasticity elasticity it's done uh, it's 29000 keep per inch square okay now minimum yield stress f i okay minimum yield stress or minimum yield stress is 60 6 uh, 0 keep parenthesis square and we'll consider that as 9 0 0 9 sorry 9 0 0 this is the, sorry 9 90 this is the maximum this is the maximum tensile stress okay so uh, it's done actually so press ok for river and also you can change that color display color so consider that as red then press ok so we have defined our, our materials for uh, fc prime and for river ok this is for our materials type and this is for our river so also now we can delete that this is not necessary and uh, actually we cannot delete that two uh, types because also you can delete that and uh, here only the I mean that value you can delete that because this is the default by that software so here is a two materials type so we have successfully defined our material the press ok so I'll just save that model save that and I'll save it in desktop this is your C CSI SAF is safe 2016 tutorial tutorials and I'll go to that folder and give a name like this is safe okay I will just save that uh, folder in that name and always I will use that uh, data for our next work 
so click here save so it is done so um, in our next video I'll just show that how we'll uh, define our different types of slab property beam properties and other uh, materials that are required for our uh, next work and first of all I will define everything what are required then I will go for final work okay so I mean um, when we'll go for final work it will be very easy if we define everything first of all so thank you thank you very much stay still stay connected till next video